Ooh. Ooh. Damn, bitch, I'm loving this jig, bro. What the fuck? This shit make me feel like I'm playing a Pokemon dating sim, bro. Uh, I, I never touched dating sims in my life, but yeah, it was good, everybody. Welcome to Pokemon True Destiny. Now, this is the Pokemon fan game that I actually found on Relic Castle, which has a lot to do with more of the murder mystery shits. Like, you know, Knives Out. Um, I, I don't really know any of the murder mystery stuff, but Knives Out is a good movie that's like murder mystery. And I like like murder mystery type shits. And another good thing about this thing is that you're almost like the looker. You feel me? You know, y'all know how the looker is like a detective or some shit. And he got that little growl up to the side always. This is basically it, but we doing more like, you know, mystery shits we on some we on some sherlock shit I, I really don't know too much about this game i just know that i seen it i seen that it was murder mystery and i was like you know what i gotta play this shit so without further ado ah damn that bitch caught me oh welcome simpit what wait how these niggas know my name hold on oh that shit caught me that shit caught me by surprise wait to enter this program you must create an avatar we require to know some information about you are you a boy or are you a girl? Who's it? This AI talking to me? Or just like the fucking wizard from Wizard 101 talking to me? Oh, shit. All right. Now, we require that you tell us the name of this avatar. Oh, shit. Okay, so let me see. This nigga look more... I mean, he got the sassy, rich nigga look. He look like he calls people whelps. He kind of look a little bit like Giovanni's son. I'm not going to lie. You know what? This nigga look like a... Ah, since he's a detective, I'm going to go... I, bitch, I was going to say 007, but nah, let's go Daniel. Daniel sound like a detective-ass name, bro. Like a fucking undercover detective. Wait, did I just say 007? Was that nigga even a detective? No. That nigga was an assassin or some shit. My fault. What the fuck? I need to watch my movies again. I'm glad you chose to join Simp. Oh, that's a company, bitch? Nigga, I thought he was saying my name. My fault. I was about to say. How does how these niggas know my name? What the fuck? Oh, shit. What's good, gang? I ain't know this shit have voice acting. My name is Orca. If you're watching this, you're traveling to one of our bustling cities or towns in the Asmos region. In this video, I will tell you all a bit about the Asmos region so you can know what you're going into. All right, appreciate you, Orc Talk. Sound a little bit like Jew Talk from, um, wow. Oh, hell no. Nah. I just seen this shit. What kind of shit? Does, wait, does he have... Oh my fault, I didn't even I didn't even see what she said. We also have alien Pokemon. Alien Pokemon? Like Deoxys bit? Jirachi? Hold on. That's these are the two main comers of this game? Well wait, why the fuck Oh, hold on, let me investigate this Bulbasaur real quick. Is that a ghastly on its back, my nigga? Holy shit, that shit look clean as fuck. Years ago, a meteorite struck the land of what we were called back then. Hoenn, and Ooh. on it lands an alien Pokemon, which we now preserve in the newly named Asmus region. Yeah, that's that Deoxys bear. I remember Deoxys alien ass was... My fault, y'all. I'm dancing to this goddamn background music. <laughs> Ooh. Hey. My fault, my fault. Oh, appreciate you, Orc Talk. Uh, I, I can't wait to see what y'all... Well, um, what more y'all got? Oh, we... Oh, shit, what's good? Ugh. <sighs> I'm back here in little city. Whoa, little city in little sea town. If only it didn't have to be under these circumstances. <sighs> I guess I should go to my old childhood home, rack things up a little bit there. Damn, it's gonna be weird as hell. Ooh, what the fuck? Ooh. Oh my god. It's gonna be weird there without my parents being there. And shit. Wait, they on vacation or something? But it's only a natural thing that happens. Everyone's parents have to. Oh, wow. Damn. I. Wow. Damn, my fault, cuz. I was about to say, I thought they was on vacation. Ooh, ooh. I cannot get over that beat, though. This the house? Oh, this the crib. Ooh. Alright, what are we doing over here? Um. A drawer. Just my parents' clothes. I probably shouldn't go. Ooh, yeah, you don't want to go through there, man. You don't want to chuck. You know, this this is the PC, my old computer. It's been forever since I've been on it. I wonder if all my files are still on it. But now isn't the time to go looking through my computer. 
Maybe later though. Oh, okay. But yeah, you don't want to go through your parents' drawers and shit because you'll never know like if Pops got like dirty underwear or you know, you don't want to go snooping through their shit. Um, a plant. My mom used to water this every day. Damn, she was dedicated to that shit. I I, I got this little cactus right here that I be doing that shit to every day too, bro. No cap. I, even though I don't think cactus is supposed to like drink water or some shit. I, I, I don't really know. But whenever she would wake up in the morning, she would always make sure to water it every day. That's dedication, bro. Oh, I shouldn't go out yet. Oh, damn. We still got shit. Oh, oh, okay. Forgot. Murder mystery detective. My bad. Let me see. Now is not the time to sleep. Oh, shit. I thought you was tired, bitch. Hold on. What's this? We can't investigate this shit? All right. Now, what about the fridge? A fridge. Inside is milk, water, and a lot of meat. Not much is still in there though. Oh, milk? How long they been dead for? Hold on. Why is there milk still inside? That's yuck. You think the milk gone bad or some shit, bro? You're not going to throw it out? It's a sink. There's nothing inside. Nothing inside. Okay. Uh, what we... Wh I think I investigated every... Wait, what the fuck? I investigated everything. What about this clock? Oh, the clock. It's apparently been frozen at this time since their death. Oh, shit. It says 1 a.m. They always sleep at 1 a.m. So did someone break in? Hmm. That's a good question. Is there anything else that we gotta do over here? Cause let me see. Oh no. Oh, we good. Bet. Oh, all right. That's weird though. Someone broke in at 1 a.m. But the door is always locked. The pr pr fridge. <laughs> the fridge is pretty empty too. Damn. What could this all mean? Yeah, you you got. My guess is as good as yours, my nigga. I really could not. I really couldn't tell you, bro. Well. Ooh. <laughs> okay, hold on. Well, I should probably go over to my job. Oh, what the fuck? I can't hear it with this big ass beat in the background. But I guess somebody's calling me. Let me see. Hello? Who is it? Daniel, come to the lab right now. I need your help. All right, I'll be there. Wait, you just gonna accept the help like that? You don't even know who's calling you, my nigga. It sounds like it's a professor or some shit, but you sure you want to go? What the fuck? So, all right, I guess we got to go to the lab. What's this swab do, though? Yo, what's good? Is this our, like, little taxi? I guess it doesn't talk to us. What, what are you doing here? Good morning, young man. Hey, what's good, twin? Good morning. All right, let's see. Was it the gym, bitch? Come on. I just need to get an exclusive. Oh, I guess. What's going on? What the fuck? Oh, looks like the gym is closed. They don't want to let the niggas in or some shit. All right, let's go. Um... I guess this is the lab. This is the only big shit over here. Yep. Sorry, Daniel. Was I interrupting something? Uh, no, not not really, Professor Sedar. It's nothing, man. It's nothing. What happened? Look behind me. That's what happened, nigga. What? You got like two Pokeballs right there. What's What What about it? You got about like, let me see, three, six, nine, twelve. You got about like 12 other Pokeballs in this bitch right now. You can easily replace that hoe. A Pokemon got stolen? It happened last night. We made sure to lock up the lab. I don't know what the fuck happened. I ain't double checked. That's why. Wait. Wow. Didn't Daniel's parents also die last night too? What? Why would you bring that shit? Like, read the room, my nigga. Why would you bring that shit up about an up out of nowhere? Like, bro, who is this nigga? This this got to be the killer. Cause there's no reason. That's that's like what two crimes in one night. Yeah, there's no reason for this nigga to like even bring that shit up. Hold on. Sedar. Who? Yeah. Who is this nigga? Oh, random ass. Ah, I didn't properly introduce you to. This is my assistant, Buckeye. Nice to meet you, Buckeye. Face this. You too, man. I guess. Oh my fucking guys. I hate whatever, bro. Do you think the stolen Pokemon and the death of my parents are connected to each other? It's very much a possibility. Since you have experience solving mysteries and shit, you know. All I did was found your stolen Nintendo Switch. Nigga, a grown ass man with a Nintendo Switch. It's crazy. Well, I mean, I can't even talk shit because I, I, I also got a Nintendo Switch. But what, whatever. Um, yes. And now I want you to find my stolen. Po you paying me, my nigga? Am I working for free or something? Why are you like bought, demanding me that I find this shit? How's this any different? The stolen Nintendo had nothing to do with my parents' death, dickhead. Listen, you ain't gotta look into it, bro. I could always hire a professional detective. What, what the fuck you trying to say? I would like to see the person who killed my parents, though. I'll look into it, nigga. Don't worry. Whatever. I don't care. Here, I'll give you a Pokemon to help you out. Think of it as a way for me to, like, you know, say thank you. No, said I. Literally. It, it, it's really not all that necessary, nigga. Listen, bro. Just take this Pokemon. Trust me. You're going to love it. You may not want it now, but you definitely going to want that shit later. 
this shit is definitely going to help you out a lot. Well, I mean, you know, at least once it's evolved and shit. Come on out, Abra. Oh, shit. Hey, an Abra of all things? Appreciate you. Hold on, let's call you. I know who to call you. Let's call you Magic. Because you're magic, you're psychic type, you're magic. Thank you, Sedar. You really didn't need to, bro. Dead eyes. I, I I could, like, you know, punch a Pokemon in this shit and then... Hey, man, wait, hold on. Where is the special region Pokemon that you got? This better be a special region Pokemon that you gave me, nigga. What am I going to do about my job, though? Question mark. Don't worry about it. I'll call them and explain the entire situation to them. They'll understand. What This this is what Professor Elm should have did back in fucking Heart Gold, Soul Silver, Silver, Crystal, Gold, all that other fun shit. All right, let's go, Abra. What's good? Feeling optimistic, Magi? Hey, that's cute. I like that. All right, what the fuck we doing? What the fuck? Oh, that's chapter one? Just like that? Who's baby girl? Was that the prologue? Hey. Wait, who is this? Gather evidence and talk to the locals. Oh, okay, cool. All right, what's up? You one of the locals? I guess not. Hi. I'm looking into the death of my parents and the theft of the Pokemon from the lab. Do you know anything? All I know is that Basil, the gym leader here, was the last one who saw your parents. Uh, thanks for your help. New suspect is the gym leader, Basil. Oh, shit. Hi, I'm looking into the theft of the Pokemon from the lab. Do you know anything about that shit? What? Yeah, I remember the order of when people came out since I live right nearby the lab, you know? I also know that nobody went inside until after the professors left. The order leaving was Sedar, two of the researchers, Buckeye, then Nyx. Who's Nyx? Yeah, who is Nyx? Sedar's brother. Who the fuck? All right, so Basil was the last one seen with my parents, and Nyx was the last one that was in the lab, which makes him a suspect as well, but no one else has entered. Does that mean someone snuck in? Probably, bro. You think it was that, um, that one nigga Silver? That's all I noticed, though. I ain't no snitch. I ain't gonna snitch nobody out. No, nothing like that. Nothing seemed out of the ordinary. You feel me? Thanks for your help, Jit. Uh, do you know what times they left? Oh, yeah. Sedar left around, like, you know, 9 p. How you know this? You was out here in the rain just, like, peeping the time and shit like that? God damn, this kid got better fucking memory than me. Sedar left around, like, 9 p.m., and then the two researchers both left 10 minutes in between each other at 9.30 and 9.20. I feel like I got to write this down somewhere. But I, I trust my memory, bro. Trust me. Buckeye stayed until 12 a.m. And then Nyx left at 2 a.m. So that nigga Nyx is the one that stole the Pokemon. And my parents died at 1 a.m. That means Nyx was in the lab during my parents' death. He still might have done it. But Buckeye seems more likely. He did leave at 12 a.m., which was one hour before their death. I found two more suspects. Oh, shit. No, Buckeye is real sus, though. I'm not going to lie, bro. It might be. It might even be fucking Professor Sedar, too. You never know. Think I should meet up with the professor? I say, less. We, you don't want to. You sure you don't want to act like at? Sure you don't want to ask like these two fucking Jesse and James ass niggas over here? Fucking. What was that? Right, let's just go back over here real quick. Let's talk to Professor. All right, Daniel, do you have any updates? In fact, I do, Professor. We have three suspects so far. Basil, the gym leader, was the last one seen with my parents. Buckeye left way after you, and the other research has the other researchers had left the lab right before my parents' death. And Nix, your brother, was the last one in the lab. I promise you, Professor, I'm not the thief or the murderer. Wait, you, you just jumped into conclusions like that, bro. You basically fucking threw yourself out there, nigga. Buckeye, I do not hope any of these three are them, yet it seems very likely. Actually, Daniel, I have a fourth suspect for you. She's a girl named Daisy. She grew close to your pan um, to your family over the last couple of years. Damn. Like, and y'all did not find that suspicious at all? But no one saw her yesterday. It happened so suddenly, she just went missing. Four suspects, two crimes. Wasn't just for a progress update. Do you know where these four are? Basil should be in his gym, which is surrounded by a whole bunch of fucking reporters trying to interview him. Buckeye, as his right, is right next to me. Nick should be catching some Pokemon for us to research in Route 1, which is south of here. And no one knows where Daisy is. So in your interrogation with the other suspects, you should ask them where she um, went, you know? Yeah, I, I feel that. Understood, Professor. Wish me luck. Hey, come here, Buckeye, since you don't, since you're over here. So you want to interrogate me. First yeah. of all, why did your ass stay inside this damn lab all the way up until 12 a.m.? 
I was doing my job. I was looking over the third Pokemon and gathering info on it. Was the third Pokemon there when you left at 12? Yes. Once <laughs> let me let me get let me get the little nerd voice going on. Once I um once I was done for the night. Once I was done for the night researching it, I put it back in his Pokeball. And this and put it on the table. You sure you didn't misplace it or some shit? Then I left the lab and headed to my house. See lying uh about going to his house. Damn, do I want to believe him? Wait. Believe Buckeye or don't? I don't like the attitude that he gave me earlier. I don't believe your ass. Buckeye, how am I supposed to trust you? I just met you when Sedar asked me to look into this. I'm pretty sure that that I'm pretty sure that you just went straight to my parents' house. Daniel, I promise you on everything I love on this job, bro. On this job, I promise you I never went to your parents' crib. I need an alibi or a fact, not just promises from a stranger, my nigga. Yeah, he, he, he got a point. I'm not going to lie. You can't just trust everybody's word, nigga. Trust me. Daniel, if you go around not trusting anyone, you're not going to get anywhere in your fucking case. Yes, be open for people to lie. But if you assume everyone is lying, then you're going to go... Then you're going to get nowhere. You're just going to be running in place. Do you have any facts or alibis to hold up to your promise? No, but ask Nix. No, but ask Nix. He was there after me. He could tell you that I did not steal the Pokemon once I left. Ah, uh, yeah, you you know what? I right, I will. Is that all your questions? Nope. Still have one more for you, ass. Do you know where Daisy went by chance? Uh, I'm sorry. I don't have any idea. Um, yesterday she just vanished out of the blue. And it seems like no one has any idea where she is. <sighs> you know what? Thanks for your help, nigga. Useless as fuck. Ladies. Hey, should I ask these niggas? Hold on, let's see. These regular ass fucking... What's good? Oh, you, you can't... They just here to just be here. They, you can't talk to them, really. Alright, so let's see. Who are... Oh, we talking to the fucking... To the suspects. Can y'all get the fuck out the way? Who are you? Yeah, I'm Daniel. I'm trying to get inside of the gym. Fine, I'll move. Yeah, get the fuck on out the way. Move. Stupid asses. That was good, bro. Hi, I'm Basil. Are you, um, are you of those reporters back there? You inside of an empty gym hiding from two reporters, bro? Are you good? Um, no, I'm just here to interrogate you. Interrogate me? Interrogate me for what? Listen, bro, you was the last one who saw my parents last night, Basil. Then my parents died. Oh, I didn't know I was going to be a suspect. Uh, what questions do you have for me? What time did you meet up with my parents last night? It was right when I closed the gym for the night at 9 p.m. I bumped into Sedar and wished him a good night. I went to your parents' house, ate some food with them until about like, I think, 10 p.m. And then I went to my crib and fell asleep. Were you awake anytime close to 1 a.m.? Definitely not, niggas. Trust me. I need my sleep by about 11 p.m. But I got to get that nice eight hours in still. So Buckeye and Nyx were, um, were still in the lab when you were asleep. Can Sedar be... Can set our backup you sleeping? Do you have anyone else that can confirm this? Yeah, actually, you know what? There are security cameras that cover the whole town. You'll see everyone who goes in and out, and it also shows you the time, too. How do I get access to that jump? You'd have to go to the city past Route 1. It's south of this town, actually. All right, last question for you, cuz. Do you know by chance where Daisy went? You know, baby girl, blonde hair, kind of. I think she got like a little red dress going on. Daisy? Yeah. I saw her just this morning. Wait, what the fuck? She challenged the gym. Rookie mistake. She said she was going to the um, city past Route 1. She had a friend she wanted to see there. Thanks for the information, cuz. Appreciate you. Daniel, you entered my gym. You're not going to leave till we have a gym battle, bruh? Do I have to battle you? I only have an Abra. Don't worry. It, bruh, wait. I got work to do. I, don't, I ain't got this nigga. Before I... Hold on. I'm about to just bring the reporters in and you can leave my ass alone. This nigga's not serious right now. In the middle of my work? The suspect battle? Ooh. Hey. And he got two Pokemon on top of that. What the fuck? I can't believe that he got my ass. What the fuck? Hit this boy with a reflect. Wait, what the fuck? Okay. Easy, thank you. Oh, speed rose? This shit ain't gonna do nothing to me. Sable your ass, ladies. Can't do shit with that. Boom, side beam. 
God damn, what kind of Abra is this? Fomantis? Hit you with the... Eh, nah, not really. You know what? Hit you with the little sign beam. Beam? God damn, what kind of Abra is this? Hold up. This man wiped out this whole nigga's team. I even try. The or Orchid badge? Just like that. Thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Hey, ladies, man. Damn, I was not expecting that damn battle. Uh, fuck out my way, please. Thank you. Uh, I don't know how y'all even get inside. The, the gym was completely open. I don't know if Cuz, like, unlocked that shit for me. All right. Yo, what is good with this Altaria over here? Should I investigate your ass, too? This thing's just waiting there. All right, let's see what's going on with this town over here. Ah! Sorry, you startled me. So, how do I go through here? Are you not from around here? I grew up here, but I haven't been here in a while. Oh, yeah. Orc Talk completely redid Route 1 in the last six years. Who? What? Damn, he got that much money? Great. It'll be so easy to find Nyx here. Here, let me show you the lay of the land over here. A lot has changed. Oh, cool. Appreciate you. The tall grass, you probably know about it. Recently, Pokemon have been popping up out of the tall grass and becoming more visible. Of course, Pokemon still hide in it. But you may want to stay alert. It's very good to know, twin. Uh, wait, what? Why would you bring me back up here when I could have just, like, you could have just said, yeah, never mind. Here are 10 Great Balls so you can catch some Pokemon along the route. Also, to help, what? Damn, this nigga gave me, oh, shit. Hey, thank you. What the fuck? Who is this nigga? Is this Nyx? This is just some random nigga that just gave me 10 Great Balls and an EXP share. Appreciate you, twin. Yeah, hey, that's a good ass guide right there. What the fuck? It was good. Oh, no, I already got a psychic type. Never mind. Oh. Ah, hey. Can I use this? Boom. Bro, why would you use that, brother? This chill ass shit, bro. What the fuck? Oh, he tried to use growth twice. Nah, we're not playing that today, twin. Not gonna play that. Hell no. Nah. Tweaking, boy. Alright, let's keep it, let's keep this going. Ooh, ooh. What the fuck? Hey, hey, what the fuck? What the fuck? Why you even wanna fuck with me? Hey, hit the one way real quick. Hey, this nigga. <clears throat> to go further, you'll have to pass through me. Oh my god. And why is this nigga so huge? Pause. I'm gonna send out Makuhita. And that bitch is level 13. How about we just do this? Really? Boom. Fuck out of here, nigga. Stop playing with me, cuz. Don't do that to me. Alright, you're actually not that bad. What'd you expect? You thought I was gonna be a scrub, nigga? You better move. Zigzagoon. Actually, my need your ass, really. Side beam. Got one shot. Boom. Perfect. Mm -mm. I, I hope y'all... Did y'all have a good Memorial Day yesterday? Like, me, I, I freaking, like, oh God, that, that was embarrassing. That was embarrassing. We don't even have, like, anywhere to heal up or shit like that. Really. Might as well catch him. We might as well just catch Cuz, bro. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep this shit going. Excuse me, um, fucking gangster. All right, let's see. Let's keep this going. God damn. Ooh, ooh, oh, shit. Dodge the fuck out that nigga. Oh, what's that, Wingle? I don't want no damn Wingle. Alright, yo, why are you blocking me? Sebastian Stone's house. Ugh. Come on, Zigzagoon. We need to go over to Drop Ford City Center. Man, you're annoying. Yeah, y'all are both annoying. Just push the ass. Never mind, don't, don't do that. Let's see. Let's see. Who's in here? Who all in here? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Mr. Stone, how's life going? How's life going on your end? Please, call me Sebastian Nix. I'm doing well. Sebastian, we have a visitor. Hey, come over here. Let's talk. What the fuck? Steven Stone? Hey, I know your dad, bro. Hold on. Sebastian Stone, I know your fucking dad. So, who are you, young man? My name is Daniel, and I came here because I wanted to find Nyx, and which I did. I was requested by Professor Sedar to get a keystone from Sebastian, so, so I, I can talk to you all you want after I get it. 
Uh, okay, I'll wait outside then. No, it's no problem. Stay inside. Oh shit, it's kind of getting like a little mysterious. Okay. So Sebastian, do you have any spare keystones on hand? No, my ancestor Stephen, ancestor, god damn, definitely would have had one on him though. Just yes. hearing about him, I know that he was a lot more put together than I was. What the fuck you mean by that? He was a bot or some shit? He probably was. AI and shit like that, you know? I completely understand. You know where to call me if you get any of that, um, any of that stuff that you can give away. You feel me? <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Anything for an old friend, boss man. Like, just like that. What's up? What's good, Nix? Why did you come looking for me? You're a suspect for the murder of my parents. And the theft of a Pokemon from the lab in the town above. So you're here to interrogate me. Well, go ahead. Ask any questions you want. This nigga's a suspect. Real suspect. This nigga's like way too quick with it. He's too aggressive. My first question is, what were you doing in the lab all the way up until 2 a.m.? Oh, that's simple, really. Adding the data for Pokemon for the Pokemon we recently collected into the lab's database. It takes a long time, especially since we've been gathering, um, we've been getting a lot of data on a lot of Pokemon. So wait, you was doing that? And I do believe Buckeye told me that he was doing the same shit. Hmm. 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 Buckeye had stayed until 10 though, I think. You stayed up until 2 a.m. in the lab researching and shit. Hmm. Ah, Brutrid. Here. Daniel, let me introduce you to my partner. Nigga, is that not... Wait, it can make itself invisible to the human eye whenever it feels like it? It's a ghost type, so it can also go through objects and possess Pokemon and humans? Wait. Buckeye asked me to ask you this question. Was the Pokemon that was stolen last night still there when Buckeye left? I don't think so. I didn't really pay attention to it. Hmm, hmm, hmm. This, the, his partner Pokemon though, it's like kind of iffy. I didn't even check it once Buckeye left. So for all I know, Buckeye could have stole the Pokemon. No, you, you, you like jump into conclusions. I was never told, Nix. What is this third Pokemon that was stolen from the lab? Ah, the third Pokemon stolen from the lab? Its name is Kankwort. It's a rock poison type. Hmm, my nigga, that looked just like a rock poison type. Your partner Pokemon, cuz. What did you do once you left the lab? After I left the lab, it, wait, hold on. It's either he killed my parents because he got the ghost type Pokemon that can possess people and Pokemon and shit, or he stole that Pokemon, or he could be both. Who knows? Uh, blah blah blah. And slept until today. I headed over to the lab, and the professor and the professor told me to head over to Route One to catch Pokemon for us to research. If there's a Pokemon that went missing, why would the professor just nonchalantly tell you, just hey, we lost the Pokemon. Go ahead. Take your partner Pokemon, go research. I don't know about this nigga. Were you ever outside the lab around 1 a.m.? 1 a.m.? No, I don't think I was. I think I was still in the lab. You can check in the secu you can check on the security cameras. I never left the um lab until 2 a.m. Do you have any more questions, cuz? Nope, I don't. Thank you for your time. Before we leave, how about we have a poke? Uh sure, why not, bro? Like, I, I always wanted to battle an Abra. Uh, sure, I want... Okay, cool. This nigga's like down to, to battle and shit. Hey, ah, another suspect battle. Wait, this one might be different though. Look at the fucking background though. Wait, is the background music different? God, what the fuck? Hold on. Side beam your ass. Because you a ghost town. Fuck out of here. Are you dumb? <laughs> I've always wanted a battle. Fucking Abra. This nigga must have forgot Abra is a, uh, let me see, psychic type? You have a ghost type? Goofy? How? <laughs> you should see my face in real life, bro. How did you defeat me, this nigga asks. Let me know if you need any more help. Uh, I should help head over to the lab because if I find a hidden entrance, we might get more suspects or just throw away the security camera idea altogether. Alright, so I guess we're going back to the lab. You know what? What better way to get back to the lab instead of leaving you guys on a nice little cliffhanger? So this was Pokemon True Destiny. Um, I'm not going to lie. I think it's only a demo right now, and I do believe it's only chapter one that's out. But I do want to leave you guys on a, like, um, on a little cliffhanger. If you really if y'all really want to find out what happened or what's about to happen, what's going on, who killed the parents, who stole the Pokemon. I do believe that this shit also goes into chapter two as well. 
leave a like down below let me know what y'all think about the game if y'all want to see more if y'all want to find out what the fuck is going on because i definitely want, want to find out leave um leave a comment let me know what y'all think subscribe if y'all want to see some more pokemon content like this i'm gonna catch you on the next game peace